everybody, welcome to another HG tutorial. And this one, uh, as you can see by the title, is going to be how to download and install Internet Explorer 8 to upgrade your current version of Internet Explorer. So just to show you guys that I currently have the version of Internet Explorer uh, that you may be using right now, I'm going to try to find IE7 in my, uh, my rocket dock to the left. So here we go. Um, I've, I currently have Internet Explorer version 7, and in order to find out what version you have, you can tell number one by the look of it, and number two just by going, I believe, um, I'm guessing here, uh, to tools and uh, something about internet options, and that'll probably give you some information about your web browser. Uh, but basically, I just want to let you guys know that I do have Internet Explorer 8, and I'm going to be showing you guys in this tutorial how to upgrade to, in I have, I'm sorry, I have Internet Explorer 7, and I'm showing you guys in this tutorial how to upgrade to IE8. So here we go. I'm just going to open up Safari for the purpose of this download. And I actually already have uh, the link to this in my um, in my clipboard here. So I'm just going to paste it into Safari. It really doesn't matter what web browser you use to download it because installation is a breeze. So here we go. This is the Internet Explorer 8 homepage. It is completely out of beta and this is the full-on brand new version of Internet Explorer 8. And right, of, uh, right here on the front of their site is the Download Now button and that's all we're going to do. I'm just I'm going to definitely have some more reviews about IE8 later to come, but this is definitely um, just the installation video. I'll make it a response to my Safari 4 beta video. So here we go. Um, first of all, if you're a Windows 7 user, you have to do uh, follow these steps. If you're a Windows, if you're an other um, operating system user, you have to select your operating system. So I have my uh, Windows Vista, so I'm just going to click on it. And now it's going to ask me uh, to choose my language. So first I'm just going to, obviously my language is English. I'm going to scroll down and hit the download button. When you hit that button, this little window right here will come up. Security warning, warning just hit run. It is a 13.3 megabyte download, and it's pretty fast because it's coming from Microsoft to a Windows machine. So there, uh, the 13 megabytes is done downloading, and we're going to wait for a little pop-up window to come up here. And um, meanwhile, I'm going to, actually I'm going to exit out of Safari um, before I run the installer. Alright, here's the installer right here. We're just going to hit the Run button to run the installer, and I'm going to exit out of my web browser in the background so we can give full, uh, full memory to this, um, or full memory uh, priority to the installation process. So here we go. It says, Welcome to Internet Explorer 8. And before you begin, it says, We recommend that you save your files and close all programs. So I'm going to just save this. I'm not going to close everything. Um, IE8, as simple as that. So what we're going to do is just hit the next button. It's very simple installation. You have to accept everything that they tell you, and it's to install updates. So just hit next. And um, I'm, I'm not going to let, let have you guys watch the entire thing, but basically it's going to download. It's going to install Internet Explorer 8. It'll install all the updates necessary in case there's a, an earlier or a later version. And then it's going to finish the setup, clean up all the temporary files, and uh, probably launch Internet Explorer 8. So I'll bring you guys back to the screen uh, when it is done installing Internet Explorer 8, and I'll get back to you. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I went downstairs and let the uh, installer run, and I came back upstairs, and this is the screen that greeted me. And it says, Internet Explorer was installed without the latest Windows updates. To install them, restart your computer. So I'm going to hit restart later for the purpose of finishing uh, this tutorial. And um, that's basically all you need to know. Um, I will restart my computer and show you guys what Windows or Internet Explorer 8 looks like. And that will be the end. So thanks for watching. Peace.